Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So alongside Google rolling out their latest version of Chrome on the 27th of September, Brave have also rolled out their latest version of the Brave web browser on desktop version 1.44, which has also been upgraded to the latest Chromium version, version 106. Now there's quite a lot going on with this latest update in version 1.44. And first of all, before we get into the new features and, imp and improvements, which I can actually show you for the purposes of this video. And once again, just to do a couple of quick mentions, um, the Brave Wallet, as always, um, has received numerous improvements, add-ons and fixes. Too many to mention in this video. And Brave seems to be upgrading and updating and improving the, improving the Brave Wallet with basically every update that rolls out to the browser. And if you are interested in all those improvements and add-ons, you can just go check those out more in depth for yourself in the release notes if that would be of interest. And then over and above those um, add-ons and improvements for the wallet, there's also eight security fixes for the actual Brave web browser itself. So it's important to double check your browsers up to date for those security fixes that have rolled out in version 1.44. And then over and above the security fixes, we also get a whole lot of bug fixes. Um, there are 11 bug fixes in total, so if you have experienced any stability problems, bugs, issues, or just general uh, problems and issues in the browser, then just double check it's up to date as 11 bugs have been fixed in this latest update. And then also they've updated the, the Brave Rewards page to handle smaller window sizes and that would be for smaller devices so that's a nice upgrade to the brave rewards now just getting into some of the new features um, which i think would be of interest for the purposes of this video um, you'll notice here in the toolbar in the top right show site panel and they've added a reading list which opens by uh, default on the left side of the browser and um, very similar to the reading list and the site panel in google chrome where you can add your articles here to read later in the reading list or you can add the current tab. So the site panel now with that reading list available in the Brave web browser on desktop. And then if you don't want the icon in the toolbar, you can just right click and hide site panel or you can just head to your settings, appearance page and here you'll see show site panel button and you can also toggle it off and on from the appearance page in the settings menu. And then heading on to another new little improvement. Um, the tab hover mode configuration options have been added now to um, the appearance page as well. So yeah, you get some um, new options called tab hover mode and we get three different hover mode options. The default is card. So if I just open up a new tab just to demonstrate. If I hover over that, you'll see it's just a card new tab and it, it appears as a card and card with preview and you'll see there's the card with the thumbnail preview and tooltip and then if I go to the new it just gives me that new tab tool uh, tooltip so tab hover mode now available in the appearance page with those three different options and then moving on along to the next um, new option um, they've added the ability to show a solid color background on the new tab page so if we head to the customize um, yeah, you'll see solid colors now, which I think is a nice improvement and a, a move in the right direction as it just gives you an option now to customize that new tab page in the Brave web browser. And then, of course, you have a whole lot of different options here and colors you can choose from just to customize the new tab page to your own choice and preference. And then you can just put things back to how they were um, if you'd like a change. And then um, they've moved the Show Brave Rewards icon uh, in the address bar to be displayed under the Brave settings. So once again, if we head to um, the Brave Rewards settings, um, Brave Rewards, if we head to the top here, show Brave Rewards icon in address bar. Um, you'll see if I toggle that off now, that Brave Rewards icon disappears. So that's now been added um, and to be displayed under Brave Settings Rewards. And then regarding the Tor private browsing, um, if we head to the privacy and security um, there's a new option here for Tor uh, private window with Tor so um, yeah we can see new private window with Tor and if we toggle that off now that removes the option for the new private window with Tor so that's been added now to the privacy and, and security settings page 
now with version 1.44. And um, I think that's more or less uh, in the way of new features that would be of interest. And then over and above that, um, we get the all important security fixes that have rolled out um, with version 106 of the latest Chromium platform, which the browser is based on. And uh, before we have a look at those, um, it's always good to double check that your browser is up to date if you are dealing with security issues. So we head to the menu to do this, click on About Brave, and um, as mentioned, the latest version and build now is 1.44.101. That's the latest release for the actual browser, and then the Chromium version 106.0.5249.65. Now, just to go through these security fixes quickly, um, it's very similar to uh, the Chrome web browser. So it's 20 security fixes that have rolled out. Um, five of those are high-risk um, vulnerabilities that have been addressed. And then we get a couple of medium and some lows. So it's important to double-check your browsers up to date as the Chromium platform addresses uh, 20 security vulnerabilities in the Chromium um, engine and platform. And five of those high-risk. And then, as mentioned, you can click on... Uh, the version which will take you to the release notes and as mentioned earlier if you are interested in all those extra features for the brave wallet um, there were um, too many to mention in this video so if you are interested you can just go check out the release notes where you can get some more information so that's more or less what's new in version 1.44 of the brave web browser now on desktop so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one